The Beijing Winter Olympics may be six years away, but the president of the International Olympic Committee is already talk talking about it. Thomas Bach is in Norway to watch the Winter Youth Olympics. In an exclusive interview with CCTV's Dan Williams, Bach predicts the Beijing Games will be a success for both China and the athletes. Watching the stars of tomorrow. The International Olympic Committee president, Thomas Bach, appeared to enjoy the competition at the Winter Youth Olympic Games. Chances are that some of the athletes that shine here will do the same in the 2022 Winter Games in Beijing. Even though it's six years away, Bach gets enthusiastic at the mere mention of Beijing. Uh, this uh, will be excellent Olympic Games. Uh, there I have uh, no doubts uh, about, uh, given uh, the great uh, determination and the experience uh, of uh, China in organizing uh, big events. Uh, I think uh, we all uh, can be very, very confident uh, that these games will be excellent. Beijing! Organizing a Winter Olympics is one challenge for China. Another is building a team that can light up the competition. In the 2014 Games in Sochi, China finished 12th in the medal table. But back expects improvements. China knows uh, that uh, part of uh, the success uh, of uh, games uh, always depends also on the success of the home team. Uh, so uh, I've been informed uh, by the president of the National Olympic Committee, Mr. Liu Pang, uh, recently about uh, the many activities uh, the NOC is already undertaking in forming a strong uh, Chinese uh, team. One of the selling points of the Beijing Games was the potential legacy it could create. It's estimated some 300 million people could now take up winter sport in China because of the successful bid. And Bach believes that process is underway. We see the first effects uh, already now uh, after uh, the election of uh, Beijing. Uh, uh, we can also see a uh, highly increased interest in winter sports uh, in China, not only in uh, Beijing. And I think uh, this uh, will uh, continue and even accelerate the closer we get uh, to the Games. While Lillehammer has backs full attention, he's already thinking ahead to Beijing, which in 2022 will become the first city in the history of the Games to host both the Summer and Winter Olympics. Dan Williams, CCTV, Lillehammer, Norway.